Rio is the United Nations Agency for Industrial Development. So what we are doing in Egypt, we are trying to help the industrial sector to develop. And we are doing this especially focusing on the small and medium enterprises because they are those in need of our assistance most. So we know that the agro-industrial sector has a great potential in Egypt and that's why we are focusing on that. And what we are trying to do is indeed to increase the productivity of this sector, the use of the resources and the value addition on the natural products. So for instance, we are working on value chains such as the value chain of tomato processing, helping farmers improve the variety of tomatoes, the way they are producing them, creating new greenhouses that will increase the productivity and the yields, but especially helping small-scale enterprises to add value to their products by drying tomatoes or other vegetables, horticultural products, and by preserving them and processing them into paste, gems uh, and other food products uh, because by doing that they will increase their income. Just as a matter of example, in the value chain of tomato, you can increase the value of the product uh, 1 to 10 by processing uh, the tomatoes and simply by putting it in jars uh, with vegetable oil. So the income for the farmers uh, will be really will have a major boost by having this type of processing and value addition. We're not only focusing on the agricultural side of agro-industries, we're also visualizing other opportunities. For instance, another type of activity that is featured here in this fair is focusing on the creative industry sector because we know that there are lots of excellent skills in Egypt producing uh, handicraft, producing textile, uh, carpets, uh, producing uh, small uh, utensils uh, that we are trying to help in innovating their products uh, so that they can produce something which is new on the market uh, and capture new clients. We are also focusing a lot on the uh, recycling sector and here you will see that we are featuring uh, some bags, for instance, produced from recycled plastic using Egyptian cotton in combination. We are also showing some new tiles, wood tiles, that are made with recycled palm wood. So it's natural products that are making use of waste but they have a very good market acceptance because they are new and innovative. So these are the type of products we are very much promoting. How we do that? Collaborating with the private sector. We work with those enterprises, we work with the NGOs, we work with the government and government institutions that can extend assistance to them, creating skills, promoting business planning, putting them in contact with financial institutions. Another major uh, sector of our activities uh, is energy and environment. Uh, we know that uh, energy is a big issue in Egypt nowadays. Uh, there is scarcity of energies, uh, there are power cuts, uh, the energy prices are increasing, uh, so we are really trying to see what can be solutions. And that's why we are working especially on two main topics. Uh, one is energy efficiency, because we know that the industrial sector in Egypt is highly inefficient. We have done a benchmarking study to compare with other similar countries and we know that the industry in Egypt is consuming much more energy than it could. And as we always say, the cheapest source of energy is energy saving, is consuming less energy. And we are helping the industrial sector to reduce the consumption of energy so that they can reduce their cost. We are also working on new sources of energy, renewable energy. And Egypt is a leader in terms of solar energy because Egypt has the best sun radiation in the whole world. So we are helping Egypt to take advantage of this good natural resource and use solar energy for producing electricity 
but also in industrial process for heat and cooling applications because we know that this can substitute a lot of fossil fuels and help alleviating the energy crisis in Egypt.